Now, at the same time, traffic jams are a constant problem for mega cities across the world. However, according to a new study, India's financial capital, Mumbai, bears the worst brunt of traffic snarls. A new study on traffic congestion based on GPS data has revealed that commuters in Mumbai spend an average of 65% more time on the roads during peak hours than when the roads are free. India's capital, New Delhi, is on the number four spot with 58% congestion. Colombia's capital, Bogota, and Lima in Peru are number two and three, respectively. The survey analyzed data from 403 cities in 56 countries. What's making Mumbai roads so congested? That's the big question. Well, one of the main reasons is car density. Mumbai's car density rose by 18% in the last two years. City now has 518 cars per kilometer. Another woe worsening traffic is narrow roads thanks to the construction of an ambitious metro line in the city. Lack of parking spaces also adds to traffic with the private cars resorting to parking on the streets, restricting space for traffic. Mumbai also has a, in fact a, a notorious reputation for pothole ridden roads and the problem is set to get worse during the coming monsoon season. Let's uh, shift focus to Australia now. Australia's federal police uh, conducted searches and raids at the headquarters of Australian Broadcasting Corporation in Sydney. As per the national broadcaster, these searches were in relation to a show it ran in 2017 named The Afghan Files, an investigative into the, the unlawful killings committed by Australian Special Forces in Afghanistan. The police said the search was an accord here in relation to allegations of publishing classified material contrary to provisions of the Crimes Act 1914. The channel had obtained government uh, documents showing Australian Special Forces had killed innocent men and children in Afghanistan. Now, three journalists involved with the show were also targeted in the police searches. The no arrests have been made so far. The managing director of ABC, David Addison, said it was highly unusual for the national broadcaster to be raided in such a way. ABC has defended the show, saying it was in public interest and the truth needed to be told. Editorial director Craig uh, McMurtry term the search as a very unwelcome yes. and serious development. He also affirmed that uh, the corporation would stand by its reporters and sources. But we will be doing everything we can to limit the scope of this uh, and we will do everything we can to stand by our reporters um, and as a general observation we always do whatever we can to stand by our sources of course.